your arms can hang down a little bit more in a natural position. They're a little bit, the gap there is a little bit pronounced, where his, his hands are almost on his thighs there. So as we come back along the ground here, club comes a little bit outside, not too bad. And at the top, you got a little bit of gap. So you have a little extra knee bend in your... Where's that knee supposed to be? Just like he is? No, I'll show you right here. Doesn't have a sink up. It's okay. See his knees there. There's yeah. no gap. And then we come and I back. Got, I got my knees way apart. Huh? Yeah. Okay. Not, it's not. It's not crazy. I hear you. It's just you have almost I, a reverse that your weight's going onto your back, and then the tendency is to, to rock back in reverse C. Okay. But it's not that bad. It's just that you can you can see it, but it's not that bad. You're making a good recovery. So coming back down, you get most of your weights on your front foot at impact, which almost 90% is on his side. The muscles blistering out of those calves. There's some sick calves. Where, you, you got some calves? sick calves. Yeah. He's been working out, baby. Oh, nice high finish. Great balance. So you got a lot of good things going on for someone who hasn't played. A lot, a lot of good things going on in your swing. You keep telling me that. I might